What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another Kendama review. And here is the time for my favorite Kendama. So today, I'm bringing you and showing you the Grain Theory edition of Kendamas. So, Grain Theory is their actual own brand. They cre create and craft their own. And what makes this one so special to me is a couple years back when it was like my 16th birthday or 17th birthday, one of my best friends from middle school gave me this as one of my birthday gifts and I haven't lost it since. I'm going to continue playing it because it's all, one of my all time favorites. It has one of the coolest designs I think when it comes to a kendama, especially including on the tama itself and on the ken. This kendama has a lot of really fun and cool natural, naturally made uh, specs to it per se. The reason why I say this is because this ball well, this Tama is a lot more lacquerish than what it is when it comes to different ones. It's really hard for it to slide off. It'll usually stay on really well, point proven. And the ball has a really nice open bevel hole. And it's able to land tricks on the side if it were to land like this and whatnot. So, the reason why this one is my favorite is because I've been playing the absolute crap out of it forever. I've always been able to land tricks with it. It's really easy to continue the flow with it. It has a lot of great natural momentum with you. It's, it doesn't really have a long string at all. And it's really good overall if you're just beginning or if you're actually just been playing for a long time and looking for something new. It is actually very cheap in itself. It's only $25. Even though Grain Theory is known to go out of stock a lot of the time for what they do sell, they always somehow find a way to keep or make sure that they're able to keep at least some of these in stock. So. Let me talk about Grain Series more itself. It's just really, really small kendama business. Not many people know about it. But it's a kendama that's more focused on, or a kendama company that's more focused on bringing its charitable needs or its profits to charitable needs. But anyways, back to the normal kendama. This kendama is called the GT Captain. The GT Captain is a lot of fun. The reason for it is because the lacquered ball, like I said, the cup sizes are actually a little bit normal or bigger than normal. And the Ken itself is really lightweight. I believe this is made from a oak, oak wood. So it's really light. It's not compact like a maple one would be or like a bamboo one would be. But the ball itself is also made from uh, oak wood. And it has this really cool compass design, compass design which I really think is a lot of fun. And if you're probably not already noticing, there's a lot of scratch marks on this. That's because I do play it a lot. But anyways, what I wanted to get at today was how good Grain Theory can be towards your Kendama leveling up skills. Grain Theory has the, all these great Kendamas ranging from very low prices but also very high prices. Grain Theory is also a really good company for when it comes to having you be able to make your next step as a Kendama person or even a Kendama influencer and try to rise up your level to the next one. They really have a lot of um, great pro players who also leave a huge impact on the community when it comes to the Kendama players. So that's why I'm kind of taking this next step forward and trying to show everyone what the Grain Theory community is like and how they're also a really great community for not only Kendama itself, but towards the people who try to get interested in Kendama. But anyways, now that it's March and everything's finally opening up and everything's getting warmer and nicer and COVID's starting, COVID is still an issue, but COVID is finally starting to plateau out a little bit but anyways I was up there I was like hey you know what like you know this would be an awesome time to get a kendama clip see what I can do out in this beautiful weather if you didn't know this might be an unknown secret about kendama players but actually playing in the sun and the warmth makes you get superpowers and you do get better you didn't hear it from me though but that's a great tip for anyone who's trying to learn go out have fun get out in the sun get a nice tan do, do something active for once and try to have fun with your Kendama skills. You don't always have to land a trick, but you always want to try and at least you try to get better and level up every single time you play. But yeah, other than that, this is the Green Theories mod. It's a lot of fun. I highly recommend it. The GT Captain, as it says on the side. And hope you have a good one. Peace.